this year. So, that's, uh, you know, already you know, doing the work even before uh, the end of last year. That's how cycling works. You know, already training camp in Spain in December and getting all together. I was starting with the, the new team. You know, got to do all the work and from the clothing to the bikes and, and all that stuff. So it's been fun. Uh, you know, doing that and, and working on, you know, definitely changed over the years, you know. One year it's Garmin Barracuda, Garmin Sharp, Garmin, so just mean for Canada, you for the new Garmin, so. Less for many people, you know. Uh, no, but it's it's all cycling. I've been with the people uh, for years and years, racing amongst them, and uh, plenty of familiar faces uh, on the team, and lots of people actually from earlier in my career with, with Trek. Uh, Owning the brand Gary Fisher, so uh, for seven years for Truck Bicycle Corporation uh, before 2006. So uh, a lot of the same people still working there. Truck's a, a family-run business, so to be that big and to still have the, that ethos and you know, really being sincere about loving cycling and, and bikes, it's nice to be there. Is it work like the NHL stuff when you're between teams? Is it negotiating with agents and stuff? Is it a lot of back and forth and, and at the business level? Yeah, I mean, it's always like that. Uh, August 1st is the, the new period for, for changing teams and signing new contracts for the next season. So that all has to start uh, and get going. So um, usually by October, that's sorted yeah. for, for the next season. So it wasn't... Uh, it wasn't crazy, it was pretty simple, so. Yeah, you've, uh, you've, you've been off a busy season for yourself. Uh, you mentioned the Tour, you mentioned yeah. the Giro, you mentioned Rio. Uh, it's going to be a heck of a year. Yeah, I mean, I'm not, you know, if I'm racing, I want to do uh, at the highest level, and I think uh, that's still still there and still possible. So, I mean, that's that's the schedule I did last year, Giro and, and Tour de France, so. Um, that's, uh, that's where I want to be again. I mean, it, it's definitely a big, big season, but that's what I'm used to. So that's what I, that's what I'm working for, and that's where I want to be. Um, but try not to think about that too much right now. Just doing the work, and I'll get back to Spain, get settled in, and start the season uh, over there and work my way towards. Rio uh, intriguing on several levels. Uh, three spots for Canada, which is rare. You got the, not just you this year, yeah. and uh, and the rider type course demanding climbs yeah. and cobblestones. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be, uh, again, Rio sort of the last thing on my mind right now, but if uh, the season goes away, it can, and I'm hopeful to be there in a good way. Um, certainly with three guys, I think, can't, you know, Canadian cycling uh, is at its highest level. I mean, that shows that, that the guys were able to go. Uh, on the continental circuit, uh, you know, Canadians on domestic teams in North America and, and race well and get that qualification. Uh, it's a complicated procedure. Uh, you know, for example, USA only has two spots for the men's road race, so uh, I think that's a big, uh, big compliment to, to the guys and the way that they approached it. I you know, went and got it done, so three spots, I mean, that's huge. and. Uh, I'd definitely be honored to, to be there and if not myself going for a result, you know, helping the team in any way possible. I know that I got the experience. Yeah, that's a good question. I mean, uh, you know, I'm just enjoying right now, you know, uh, the sport. I mean, it's so hard. You have to be in the moment and doing the work. And, uh, you know, sometimes I, you know, catch myself daydreaming, you know, what's past cycling. But uh, right now, uh, I'm a little bit too busy for that. So, yeah, we'll see. I want to just get through this big year, a big challenge, and uh, I'll reflect. And we'll see where to go from there. This year in the tour? Yeah, that's the plan. That's the plan. You know, if I get to the Giro d'Italia, the Tour de France, and the Olympic Games in uh, Rio, uh, I'll come home after that. And that, uh, you know, that lets me uh, be here in the end of August. So that's the plan. A lot has to happen to, to get to that point, but you know, that's the goal. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it.